Welcome back. I'm here with our newlyweds, Mike and Amber McKinnon. Congratulations to you. Thank you. You feel a little less nervous now, Amber, or are you still, your heart's a still pounding? A little less, yeah. <laughs> it's, this, the hard part is over now. Yes. No, it's so not true. <laughs> I, I wish it were true. You, but, you know, this is the most wonderful thing you guys have done, and you're going to be very happy together. I know it. And you can always look back, and you can just look at the tape, and <laughs> look how Patrick is aged and everything. Speaking of which, <laughs> Patrick, Hair you're the... falling out while we watch. <laughs> you're the best man. I think it's appropriate. You've got to give us a toast. Right? I'm going to try to keep this simple. Uh, last person I, I gave a best man toast to is somebody I did close to 60,000 miles in a car with and known for 10 years. Uh, I haven't known you guys that long, but I'll tell you what, the same lights in both your eyes when you said the vows is a beautiful thing to watch. I hope that lasts for the duration of your marriage. To your health, to your Cheers. future. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, let's cut the cake, kids, all right? Yeah. Mike and Amber, we've got a lovely uh, cake knife for you. Do you see the cake we did? We have a picture of the bride and groom, and we have the screen savers on there. Uh, I guess, Amber, you should come around here and just to amazing what you front. do with an inkjet printer you can, in you your can, spare time. Yeah. <laughs> you did that yourself? That's pretty good. That's, that's very nicely done. And uh, should, we, should we just have, should I tell them what their, uh, their wedding gifts are now? Or we, Okay, you both cut the cake, so why don't you both go over there? You do the, it's been a long time since my wedding. I forgot how this happened. Let's see. I'll tell you, I'm more nervous now than I was at my wedding. So go ahead and both of you uh, hold, it, hold each other's hands. There you go. And cut the first cake. Try to avoid uh, Amber there. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> oh, there you go. Isn't that nice? And the beauty of being the bride and groom is you only have to cut one piece. We'll, we'll make Megan cut the rest of the pieces. Okay. That's great. All right. All right, so, so uh, come on back around, because I want to tell you something. You too? You know, this isn't, this isn't it. We've actually, we managed to get together some pretty nice wedding gifts for you. Now, I know your friend, where are your friends and family? Are they up in Seattle watching this mm -hmm. on TV? Okay, you want, is there anybody you want to say hi to as long as, as, long as they're watching? Come it's on, all the hi. family is all I can say. Okay. <laughs> all right. <laughs> and I'm sure, name. I'm sure they have some wonderful wedding gifts for you as well, but your friends at the Screensavers came up with a few little items. Are you ready? This is, uh, this is from us to you, and because there's two of you, we've got two of these. Two Palm M130 color handheld computers, courtesy of Palm Incorporated. Two RCA force feedback web mice, courtesy of the Immersion Corporation. And two Pavilion 760N desktop computers with 17-inch V70 monitors, AMD Athlon XP 2000 processors. That's right, two of each for each of you. Those are computers courtesy of Hewlett Packard. Plus, there's more. A fabulous gift basket filled with tech TV and screensavers goodies. Some of these nobody here has. You Unique, exclusive goodies just for you. Oh, wait a minute. There's one other thing I, I have in my pocket. I forgot all about this. this I made it with the rings. This is good. I can't get it. It's kind of jammed in there. This is a, can you help me? Get that out of there. The it's a, a DCR 120BT oh, wow. mini digital video camcorder for you. Oh, wait, wait, courtesy wait. of Sony Electronics. There's a catch on this one. Well, there is a catch. We're going to put you to work. Because the reason we're giving you the camcorder is because you'll need it to capture the beautiful scenery and lifelong memories on the honeymoon we're giving you. Mike and Amber, you're going to be treated like a king and queen in the castle capital of the world, Wales, England, just two hours from London. You'll begin your dream honeymoon in Cardiff, the cultural hub of Wales. Patrick's been there. He agrees. It's the cultural hub of Wales. Romance awaits you. The dramatic coastline will take your breath away. Forget instant messenger. Chat it up with friendly locals at elegant outdoor pubs and cafes. Then you'll travel to northern Wales and stay in ultra-luxurious ancient Norman castle in Port Marion. This romantic honeymoon, airfare, accommodations, ground transportation, and oh, so much more is all yours, courtesy of the Wales Tourist Board and the Screensavers. But you have to take pictures and bring them back to your family back here at the Screensavers, all right? Can I pass out now? <laughs> yeah, but again, make sure you go this way, all right? And that's pretty good, huh? Oh, Congratulations. Wow. We had a feeling you need dual computers, because I have a feeling you each have your own thing that you're oh, yes. <laughs> Can you use two computers? Oh, oh yes. yes. <laughs> what are you going to do with, the, with the, uh, yours, Amber? Oh, I'll think of something. Yeah. And how about you, Mike? What do you What do you like to do? I've been needing a serious upgrade. You do? Well, you got one. one. That's great. Well, I think it's great because both of you work in service to the country. You with AmeriCorps, Amber, and Mike with the C uh, the uh, Army Corps of Engineers, uh, and it's really great that you 
can we can do a little bit back for you. Give a little bit back for you. Oh, man. I think you're going to have a great time. Wow. We're going to make all the arrangements. You're going to have a wonderful time in England. Have you ever been to England? No. no. Have you been out of the country before? Never. This is no. great. You're going to have a great time. We expect postcards from both of you. All right. all we right. get video. All right. And uh, we, uh, you know, the, the, I, I kind of blew it, I have to confess, because I was supposed to take like 15 minutes on that wedding ceremony, and I rushed right through it. So we have, we have like a little extra time. That's a first. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I know. We, we, we do have some things we want to read to you, some, some well uh, wishes from all of uh, everybody uh, that uh, got online and, and, and saw the wedding and everything. And I know there are a lot of people out there who have been watching and just, I think there's some tears been shed all over the place for you guys. <laughs> you become our mascots, our, our screensavers couple. So it's really been great having you. We want to thank, see, what? What, Patrick? You, you're going to do something here? No, no, the voice spoke to me from above. Oh, the voice from above <laughs> told Patrick to stall. Oh, there are the messages. We do want to thank yeah. Celix Formal Wear for all the tuxedos worn by the groomsmen and Flowers by the Bay in San Francisco for these beautiful flower arrangements. I mean, they are just uh, stunning. And, of course, you can take them with you. And the bouquets, too. And the bridal bouquet, which is just those beautiful lavender roses. Those are, I, I think those are peace roses. I'm not sure, but they're really... They smell great. They smell great. Yes, they smell very yeah. good. <laughs> Wonderful. Let's read some of these... Uh, well wishes from uh, family Laura from Algoma, Wisconsin. To a grass tree, hard drive, and plenty of RAM. To long, cheerful emails. Are we geeks? Or this what? is a, this <laughs> is going to be something. I got to read something. Long, cheerful emails without any spam. The toast is to the geeks who will become man and wife. My best to you both and a long, happy life. Congratulations uh, to you both. This is from Laura in uh, Algoma, the, Wisconsin. Same thing. Oh, I saw you. read They're that one. Here's C.K. Wilson. May your chips fall softly <laughs> and may all your programs run smoothly. May you never have to do a reinstall and system restore be done rarely. May you all have all the mini systems and handhelds you wished. I think we've already arranged for that. <laughs> Blessings to to you both. Um, Henry Kaiser says, may your hard drives never crash, your extensions remain without conflict, may our marriage be as stable as Linux, as beautiful and rich as Maya, and as long lived as the telephone. <laughs> that's, that's really geeky. May your marriage be as stable as Linux. <laughs> But you know somebody's out there arguing, going, no, BSD! 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 Gene, uh, who is an automotive technician in Locust Grove, Virginia, said, now, you don't know any of these people, do you? Mm -hmm. Do you recognize mm -hmm. them? These are all people who just read about this online and who just are happy for you. He says, this is like a true geek's dream come true. My wife and I are so happy for both of you, and we will definitely be glued to the tech TV show, The Screensavers, on the 5th of April. Good luck to both of you, and have fun. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Sure. Uh -oh. May you both have many little geeksters. The best. <laughs> <laughs> That's from Norm. <laughs> San Sandra from Rexford, uh, New York, says, Congratulations. May you never experience the blue screens of life. <laughs> oh, boy. May you have a wonderful life together, says Joan from White Marsh, Maryland. My husband Dave and I met online almost 10 years ago before live chat was even born. We both hope you all have a long and happy life, and one way to do that is to keep two computers in the house <laughs> at all times. Absolutely. Most definitely. <laughs> they don't know what we, that we arranged. That. You know, uh, people at home don't realize this, but there's a big audience of people. This is, these are, you don't know all of these people, but these are all people who work at Tech TV uh, and who came by because they were so excited by the notion of, the, just we got a huge crowd here, by the notion of you guys coming. We just, uh, we cannot thank you enough for making uh, us, allowing us to be a little part of your uh, life here. But now we got to warn you, we're going to be watching very closely from now on. <laughs> you're, you're the official screensavers couple. Here's one from an actual reverend in Small Boat, New Jersey. Is there a Small Boat, New Jersey? Yes, there is. There's many things in New Jersey. You, you should we'll live in Small Boat. Later. Reverend Gene Moylan says, best of luck in the future, as a wise old sage once said, and I think he wants me to do this, live long and prosper. <laughs> <laughs> We've heard that one before. <laughs> We have a little time for some more. All right. All right. Nancy from Washington State, who also does admin support. Wow, Mike, I think this is way cool. I can't wait to see this. I haven't been to a wedding in so long. Congratulations to you and your bride. She is so cute. She is. <laughs> she is. You, you know, people don't know because uh, Mike was standing right next to me. But when you came out in your gown. He gasped. You did, didn't you, Mike? Yes, I did. Were you pleased? Very. Yeah. There's, that's, there's nothing like that memory. I have that memory of my wife, too. Our wife. You, you cherish it forever. <laughs> well, it's been a wonderful time. I thank you all for uh, helping out and 